Tomorrow night, the Sioux Falls City Council will decide whether to approve an ordinance that would allow Class 2 e-bikes on the city's trails and sidewalks. Kettleland's Carly Phillips spoke with one council member about why they're proposing the change and heard why some residents are concerned. Since 2018, Class 1 e-bikes have been allowed on Sioux Falls sidewalks and trails. Now, city councilors Greg Neitzer and Sarah Cole are co-sponsoring an ordinance that would also allow Class 2 e-bikes. It's time to move to Class 2 and give people that independence so they can get more exercise um, and, and participate more. There's some people that have certain challenges. Maybe they're not handicapped, but they're just getting older. Neitzert says they haven't seen any issues with people misusing Class 1s, but some residents fear the speeds of Class 2 e-bikes are too dangerous. The problem with the Class 2 is that it's, it's an assist riding bicycle, but it also allows you to use just the throttle so you can go up to 20 miles per hour with the E2 without even pedaling. And that's what they want to legalize in the bike trail on our sidewalks. Class 1 e-bikes require the user to pedal to activate the motor. Class 2 has a throttle and does not require pedaling to activate. Counselors say they plan on providing more resources on how to safely operate e-bikes. We're going to have a big education campaign to tell people you need to do it safely, you need to be respectful of other users, you need to be careful when you're using the throttle. I'm not anti-e-bikes, but uh, I just think they're just a dangerous thing for our sidewalks and for our bike trail system. In Sioux Falls, Carly Phillips, Kelloland News. If the ordinance passes, Class 2 e-bikes would be allowed on the Sioux Falls bike trail system and sidewalks starting June 1st.